हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल ऑन इंजीनियरिंग मैथमेटिक्स इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस हाउ टू कंप्यूट एरिया यूजिंग डबल इंटीग्रल्स इन पर्टिकुलरली वी विल फोकस ऑन फाइंडिंग एरिया ऑफ द रीजन गिवन ऑन कार्टेशियन प्लेन अज्यूम द रीजन इज बाउंडेड बाई द कर्व वाई इज इक्वल टू एफ वन एक्स वाई इज इक्वल टू एफ टू एक्स एक्स इज इक्वल टू ए एंड एक्स इज इक्वल टू बी देन दैट एरिया ऑन कार्टेशियन प्लेन कैन बी शोन इन दिस वे एरिया ऑफ दिस रीजन कैन बी गिवन बाय डबल इंटीग्रल्स एज डबल इंटीग्रल ऑफ डी वाई डी एक्स फ्रॉम एफ वन एक्स टू एफ टू एक्स एंड ए टू बी सिमिलरली इफ द एरिया इज बाउंडेड बाय द कर्व x is equal to f1 y x is equal to f2 y y is equal to a and y is equal to b then the area is given by double integral of dx dy from f1 y to f2 y and a to b now let us see examples based on this concept in this first example we are asked to find by double integration the area bounded by the curves y is equal to x square and y is equal to x let us see step by step solution first of all we draw the region whose area we wanted to find out here region of integration is bounded by curves y is equal to x square and y is equal to x y is equal to x square is a parabola along y axis opening upwards and y is equal to x is the straight line passing through origin and making an angle of 45 degree with positive x axis so the area bounded by these two curves is this one now let us find out area using the formula double integration of dy dx from f1x to f2x and a to b now let us find out these limits using the techniques that i have discussed in my earlier videos you can find the link of those videos in the description box to find the limits of y we have to first throw arrows parallel to y axis from bottom to top and we have to check whether these arrows are entering and leaving the region by crossing only one one curves yes it is happening now we will see which curve they cross to enter into the region of integration so they cross curve y is equal to x square so x square is the lower limit of the inside integral now check which curve they are crossing to leave the region of integration here i see they cross y is equal to x curve so x is the upper limit of the inside integral similarly we will throw arrows parallel to x axis to find out outside integral limits here we have to check which point these arrows touches first and touches last these arrows touches this point origin first here x is 0 so lower limit of x is 0 and they touches this point at the last while leaving the region here x is 1 so upper limit of this outside integral is 1 so these are the limits of y and x now finally we evaluate this double integral with integrand 1 since we are integrating inside integral with respect to y integration of 1 is y over the limit x to x square after substituting these limits in y we get integration of x square minus x dx over the limit 0 to 1 integration of x square is x cube by 3 and x is x square by 2 now we substitute these limits first we substitute upper limit in x we get 1 by 3 minus 1 by 2 then we substitute lower limit in x we will get 0 so 1 by 3 minus 1 by 2 is minus 1 by 6 so area of this region is nothing but 1 by 6 square units at then we'll take mod of this answer to write the area i hope guys you understood this concept now let us proceed for second example here we are asked to find area by double integration bounded by x square plus y square is equal to 10 and y square is equal to 9x curves let us first draw the region whose area we want to to find out here the region is bounded by the circle x square plus y square is equal to 10 and the parabola y square is equal to 9x let's draw them this circle is centered at origin and its radius is root 10 and this parabola is passing through origin along x axis opening to the right 
both of these curves intersect themselves at point 1,3 and 1,-3. minus To find out these points of intersection, you can simply put y square is equal to 9x over here and evaluate for the value of x. You will see value of x is 1. Then substituting back that value of x over here, you will get value of y as 3 and minus 3. So here bounded region is given by this blue color. Now let's find the area using double integration formula, double integration of dy dx or dx dy. You can choose this order wisely so that you do not have to split the region of integration. Now finally we find these limits using that arrow technique that I had discussed in my previous videos. Before finding these limits, I would like you to note that this region of integration is symmetric about x axis. That is the area which is above x axis is same as the area below x axis. So instead of calculating entire area, we will calculate area above the x axis only and we will multiply it by 2 to get the entire area. So this area can be now written as 2 times area above the x axis. Now we will find out limits only for the area above x axis. To do so, we will throw arrows parallel to x axis from left to right. We see that while entering into the region of integration, these arrows crosses parabola whose equation is y square is equal to 9x, therefore x is equal to y square by 9. And while leaving the region of integration, these arrows crosses this circle whose equation is x square plus y square is equal to 10, therefore x square is equal to 10 minus y square and x is under root 10 minus y square, which gives you the upper limit for inside integral. Now we throw arrows parallel to y axis from bottom to top. This time observe only the upper region above the x axis, okay, this one. So when these arrows crosses this region that touches this curve first, on this curve y is 0, so lower, lower limit for the outside integral is 0 and while leaving the region that touches this point last, here y is 3, so upper limit for y is 3. Now finally we are all set to evaluate this double integral double integration of dx dy over the limit y square by 9 to under root 9 minus y, 10 minus y square and from 0 to 3. Since inside integral is with respect to dx, its integration is x over the limit y square by 9 to under root 10 minus y square. Now we substitute these limits in x, so we get under root 10 minus y square minus y square by 9. Now we have to evaluate integral of under root 10 minus y square minus y square by 9 with respect to dy. Before evaluating this integral, I would like to recall the integration formula of integration of under root a square minus x square dx is equal to x by 2 into under root a square minus x square plus a by 2 into sine inverse x by under root of a. Here a is root of 10. So if you substitute root 10 for a over here, you will get integration of under root 10 minus y square in this way. So the integration of under root 10 minus y square is y by 2 under root 10 minus y square plus 10 by 2 into sine inverse y by root 10. And integration of minus y square by 9 is minus y cube by 3 into 9 that is minus y cube by 27 over the limit 0 to 3. Now we substitute the upper limit in y. So we get 3 by 2 into under root 10 minus 3 square that is under root 1 so we left with only 3 by 2 here plus 10 by 2 is 5 sin inverse 3 by root 10 minus 3 cube that is 27 upon 27 is 1 when we substitute 0 that is lower limit in y we get 0 plus sin inverse of 0 is 0 again minus 0 that is all three terms become 0 after substituting lower limit so we neglect to write that 0. Finally, we say that this is the area bounded by the curves x square plus y square is equal to 10 and y square is equal to 9x. I hope guys you understood this example. Now it is your turn to solve examples. I have given some practice examples over here with their corresponding final answers so that you can cross check your answers. You can pause the video and note down these examples. Guys, please write me in comment box whether you are able to solve these examples or not. 
If you like this video, please click the like button and share among your friends. I'll be coming with more such interesting topics in my upcoming videos. Till then, keep watching my videos. Thank you all of you. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe my YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get updates about my new videos.